Gemini, hi and welcome. I am doing your love reading. This is for Sun, Moon and Rising Gemini. Thank you for stopping by. Coral Tree Tarot. I am just going to cleanse my deck. Oh, I love this. Um, this is your love reading, timeless as usual and general, so please apply it um, on the If Resonates. Um, before I move to your tarot, I would like to first do some, pull some art on energy. There we go, we've got two. We've got a gateway um, and the light. I feel there is there is an opportunity for you um, expanding in your life to manifest whatever you want. This is this is like a portal that you can used to manifest what you've always wanted in your life pay attention pay attention to what you think and think of all the things that you want to happen to you and the people with all their characteristics specific characteristics if you're trying to manifest relationship Think about these because you have an opportunity to bring that into your life. There is a portal, energy portal, um, opening and expanding. There is an opportunity to really effectively manifest the light. There is an energy of joy. And that means that... There is happiness, abundance, good luck expanding in your life. Share it. Enjoy it. Spread it like the bird. Share it. And be grateful for it as well. Very joyful period. Um, and a very strong message of manifestation. Um, for you with the gateway use this portal to manifest whatever you want in your life birth very interesting someone else had it um, there is something new that is expanding in your life new opportunities new people new relationships new job you are Give an opportunity to start something over as well. Let's see what's this one we got for Gemini. Heavenly helpers, your spiritual team is guiding you through this difficult situation. So if you are dealing with some challenges... Um, please know that your angels, your, your guides, your spiritual guides, guides are around you. Close your eyes, ask them for help, ask them for guidance. And there is definitely an energy of something new expanding. So I feel with the gateway, with the portal, um, you have an incredible energies um, to work with. And you can bring them into your life. You can visualize literally that energy floating to you. These people, that person sitting literally in your, I don't know, laundry room. Or you sitting with them in a restaurant just heavily, happily chatting. Just imagine, visualize this as it, as it was present. Same with a you know, new job or the project that you're working on, the progress that you want for this project. Ask your spiritual guides and angels for help if you are feeling stuck in, in some area. They are around you. 
and you know the delight to me it means every little every little inch of success every little success that you have let's say you're doing something big it's a big project but if you spread it into little increments every that little increment every success enjoy it share that joy and again bring that energy towards you I'll pull one more here Gemini self-care oracle because of the heavenly helpers if there is something you know challenging that you're dealing with let's see action I'll show this first to you there's a staircase excuse me in the door it says baby steps are still steps and they are better than standing still I am blown away because I just said uh, that if there is something that you're working on a, a larger project whatever this is professional even relationship you know divided into little increments little steps and this basically talks about exactly this baby steps are still steps and they are better than standing still strong message about um, you know trusting yourself believing in your own abilities um, thinking in a positive way way and manifesting it there is something new around the corner with the birth you are creating something and yes, take action because each that little step is taking you to the right place, the where the place where you want to be. Okay, Gemini, beautiful. Action is required each step of the way. Every little thing counts. Rome wasn't built in a day. Relationship won't be built in a day. Career won't be built in a day, etc every little thing and and this is for you feel that delight from every little achievement you 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 have you're putting in an effort to to fix your relationship um and if you feel that it, you are getting you know the response you were hoping for enjoy because this is your energy you're putting in there and give yourself that, allow yourself to feel delighted and happy and proud. This is that delight and share it. Okay, Gemini, love reading. What's happening for Gemini in love? Please show me the energy spirit. What's happening for Gemini? This is a three card spread. Present, past, future, general energy with the bottom of the deck. And we're going to clarify things. We have nine of pentacles here. Really a strong energy of someone who is single, who's doing very well for themselves, um, who's a hard worker and a high achiever. Um, nine is also almost ten. So in terms of timing, you are almost there. You are almost at the ten of pentacles. You're almost at a certain... Uh, there's a certain completion here. Look, we've got the death. Um, you could be dealing with Scorpio. There is some, perhaps literally we could read Nine of Pentacles and the death as the end of being single. Let's see. Gemini, is that the case? There is definitely a big change coming. Big change with the death card. Big change. 180 degree change what wasn't will be what was won't be and you've got the sun as the opening energy <sighs> this person is clear it is absolutely clear for your person that you are the one you bring them joy you bring them happiness you bring them feeling of being at home you bring them hope page of wands eight of 
Swords and the Hermit. Leo and Virgo energy here. Um, Gemini. I feel... We had nine of pentacles. I feel someone's been here uh, single out of choice for a very long time. And this period is ending. We had the death sleeping. This, this period is ending. Your person may have finally figured out that the distance between you, the, 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 the distance and the fact that they have been secluded, they've been isolating themselves from you, they finally figured it out. That The hermit has finally figured out what brings them that light and that hope. Um, I feel there, there, there has been some sort of communication about, there has been some sort of, you know, I feel they have recently become more vocal about this, that uh, they are finally clear and lighted, enlightened. It is clear for them. Now the Eight of Swords for me going to the future means that it isn't easy. It's not going to be easy for your person to kind of get out of this cave that they have been. They put themselves. Um, it's not going to be easy for them to just stroll out of it and offer you love, um, ask you out, etc. They will have a period where they won't quite know how to act in it. It is simply, it's such a mental energy, this Eight of Swords. They'll feel like, yes, I know, Gemini is everything to me. But um, I am not quite feeling and I don't know, I don't know, this is such a mental energy, I don't know what to do now, I, I, I don't know, I feel constrained with that energy, that this is a major kind of hermit. Um, very strong energy of someone who has been single for a long time. The Nine of Pentacles, it's such a clear connection with this energy here and the death as the end of that period of being single. So your person has finally realized that, you know, they don't want to be without you anymore. They are very much aware that they are wanting to engage in a connection, in a relationship with you, but they, for now, they want to know how to proceed. Now, tell me more about the, the, the hermit. I actually want to know. Yes, well, this person really wanted to know four of wands here. This person really want your person. Oh, okay. These energies are fluid, so I could be reading your energy or the person that you were thinking about. This person um, really wanted to make sure that they understand what it is to have a family, understand what it is to have committed relationship. This was why. They have gone into a solitude themselves or in the modern times. They have basically kept themselves to themselves, kept doing what they were doing. Simply that they were not sure that they clearly understand what that is for them. Whether this is what they want. This person is someone who's mature uh, Gemini. These are beautiful energies, the sun and the far off ones. This person is truly thinking about commitment. These energy are these energies are mental energies. This person is clearly thinking about commitment. But this is for life. This is building stability. This isn't for two, three, five years and then changing for a new person. So I feel you are dealing with someone, Gemini, that have been single out of their own choice. They may have been distanced even. Now this is clear for them that 
you are you are the light you you bring that hope you you represent the life and the light in their life gemini there's also like they really love this youthfulness this this um bambini here that that, that little baby there's some and they also want to finally become um, vulnerable. So I really feel this person's done this for a reason. Because they have been serious about commitment, family, marriage, etc. Um, I would like to do another spread. Or should we just... What is it here? It's okay. Um, do I want to make another spread? I do. And I'm going to ask for you, Gemini, whether this person, um, whether this person that Gemini is dealing with will come forward with their feelings because we know that we you are dealing with someone who's who's isolated themselves who has been who is single has been single but they are not quite aware look the four of ones is coming back and the devil there is a very strong bond the devil talks about strong bond for them this is a very powerful and strong bond there may be a little bit of fear around that commitment that Four of Wands talks about. Stability that people build together. They are serious about it. And that is that is why they have been silent. They have been they have been single. They didn't really want to put themselves out there because they, they really want you. Um, Gemini, I want to ask. Will this person, we have Knight of Wands, they're very excited. Is this person going to express love? They are manifesting, they're heavily invested. Look at this. They are still there. Okay, look. To me, look at this, divine timing in the position of the past. This person needed their time, the temperance. They really needed their time. They have been indecisive, the two of wands. Should I commit, should I not? Is, this, is, is that it? Okay. They are, this is a magician. They are manifesting it. They are invested on every level. Intellectual with the sword, emotional with the um, cup. Um, they have committed their own time with a pentacle. It's, it's, it's such a tangible thing, time, to really figure out, to really understand what they want. And with the want, they are really eager to make it happen. They are invested in this connection. Look what's here. This person is going to surprise you. There is Hierophant here. And they just needed time to make sure that this is what they want with you, Gemini. You could be dealing with Sagittarius, Taurus and Virgo. What is it that this person is manifesting? What are they manifesting? Seven of Swords, King of Swords. Yes, I feel these are such a mental energies. Seven of Swords, King of Swords, Eight of Swords is coming back. This person's this this represents this. I needed time. I need to do something when no one's looking, and this is that th thinking. I need to be clear what I want, because I don't know how to proceed. I don't know what to do. They are manifesting. They are moving forward from these energies. 
And this ties so well with that hermit energy in the sun. They want to have clarity. I feel this person is going to be talking to you quite openly and seriously very soon. What is the Seven of Swords here? Okay, maybe you didn't know as well that when they moved away from you to, you know, think about your connection and the commitment that they felt themselves left out in the call. They, they felt abandoned. They felt the solitude. They felt that. I wanted to know what that Seven of Swords um, was. This person is going to come at you with a commitment. They just needed time. Manifest this. I think for some of you, I, I really feel that you didn't think that this is, going, this is going to happen with this person. Because, look, the sun is back again. Um, because it's been, uh, you know, the hermit in the first spread, it, 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 it's a major arcana. This could have been going on for a long time that your person um, didn't want to engage. This could have been for quite a long time. Even years. And also, mind you, these are major arcanas. Um, Sagittarius, uh, Temperance, um, Magician, and the Hierophant. Um, your person is clear now that they want commitment, that they want you in their life and only you. I do expect some very honest and... Um, clear communication and conversations happening with this person about that commitment but i don't think you're gonna go and get married sort of like right away or next year this is going to you are special to me you are so special to me mm, because these are major arcana so it's but i feel with the sun and oh what do we have here something flew Calm after the storm. Perhaps the time when your person moved away felt like a storm for you. But they needed the time. They needed it. The temperance. I have many more flipping here. So I'm going to pull one more. This one dreams come true. Beautiful. Oh, someone is doing some work here. Oh, we've got one that's sitting in the wrong way. Just one. Just one. Potential. There is a potential. Sextile is the name of an aspect in astrology. It's a very positive aspect. It's an um, easy aspect talent stimulation expression it is an aspect in astrology that basically um, talks about two energies working well together and that's why this oracle is called potential there is a potential here um, for a long-term connection I feel your person has a true clarity about that they do want a long-term relationship with you um, I feel this gateway and gateway is important here for you. I feel you need to remember to use that opportunity to manifest. Also, your person is manifesting, manifesting this connection. There is something new. 
around you, energy of birth. You're giving birth to a new chapter in your life. And if this situation, you know, it's it, it the hermit to me is is a energy of someone who's really withdrew the energy, withdrew themselves from your life, simply to figure things out. And if you kind of stayed with this person or kept in touch, I feel every little step that you have been taking and you are taking now to um, help build this relationship with this person is going to help you achieve that. So don't think that... Um, Baby steps are still steps and they are better than standing still. Everything you do for this connection really counts and you should um, give yourselves... You should give yourself a pat on your shoulder, I want to say. And feel the delight in knowing that you are contributing to building it. Because in the first place, you, you, you let your person go. You let them have their time. The first spread was clear. The hermit was clarified by four of wands. This person needed to really know for themselves that this is what they want with you. And I, with the sun... It was in a position of now. This person has clarity. They know that they want this with you, Gemini. Um, thank you for your time and energy. If you enjoyed this reading, don't forget to like and subscribe. Please subscribe to my channel. It really helps me to build this channel. Um, I'm sending you all love and light. All the very best. And I'll speak to you soon. Goodbye for now, Gemini.